guys welcome back to my channel and here you guys are seeing a 1975 Lada Vaz 2101 and like I was saying it was produced in 1975 and it's been in the family since it was brand new and in this video my friend Rafal is actually acquiring this from his friend uh, this car sat in the garage since, since the 90s uh, it needs a lot of work a lot of care uh, but there's nothing that's impossible so we're starting the restoration of this car actually like this is actually a tool for um, the engine if you want to actually turn the engine by hand and uh, on this particular car you're actually able to start the car um, you know, just by using that tool and here is the Volvo that my friend has and we're going to be using that Volvo to uh, move the car from the upper parking garage to the lower parking garage uh, and here my friend is backing it up and uh, we're getting ready to uh, get this thing rolling um, so yeah and Volvo this is a diesel Volvo is actually really rare um, you don't really see diesel Volvos in the US um, at least I haven't seen but this is uh, all happening in Europe so you see a lot of those cars there and here we have it strapped up already and ready to go um, and if you guys want to watch the entire video it's actually going to be in the description of how we were transporting this car and moving it and, you know making sure it's uh, you know and the it goes it goes from the upper to the lower parking garage uh so yeah the video is in the description below if you guys want to check it out for uh, more detailed uh clips and uh here i'm just checking the car out really quick and actually i'm amazed because the taillights look in amazing condition uh the car is obviously dusty and uh needs uh you know a wash and clean up but our first goal is going to be getting it running and all that and uh um, yeah, just, uh, you know, uh, it, it has everything is basically still original uh, from what it looks like. Uh, and yeah, she needs some welding and some things like that, but nothing that can be done. Uh, the trunk actually didn't, uh, you know, uh, give us a lot of surprises. You know, there was a lot of uh, tires in there and a few bits and parts. And actually, this spare, I think this is like factory spare right there that it still had. Reminds me of a lot of old school Mercedes, especially W115, W114 chassis has those tires set up like that. Um, yeah, and here I am on the driver's side uh, behind the seat, uh, steering wheel, and you know I'm just, uh, you know, there's no brakes uh, in this car at the moment, and nothing works. Everything's dusty and dirty, and we're just trying to, you know, get this car moving. And uh, just literally, we were kind of lucky because. Uh, you know, Raffle has a parking uh, garage or, you know, his own garage on the bottom floor. Yeah, so it wasn't really a big deal, you know, getting it moving at first, actually. And I was surprised because the the wheels were not locked up, really. Um, yeah, but now this is the tricky part. This is actually where uh, we tried. So, like, we brought this car to this point, but then there was an incline. This car has no brakes, and there's no way we could, like, tow it properly. So what we had to do is actually... Vaz was gonna be, uh, you know, here's I'm, I'm rolling, but we have a strap, uh, you know, um, tied up to the Volvo, and Volvo is actually getting backed up right now. You're about to see it, and slowly but surely, we were able to carefully, you know, uh, roll this thing down to the bottom floor without any incidents. So, yeah, and you're about to see everything else, guys, um, and the full video of this. Uh, amazing old school machine being restored uh, not restored but getting revived at first so Good work. Да, да, да. Давай. 
Приятно было познакомиться, но еще за спасибо. Да, да. Ну давай чуть-чуть пробуй. А, oh, the battery is like dead, dead. The battery is like dead, dead. Uh -huh. Yeah. Открой тут вот. Trying to start an amazing Volvo diesel wagon. It's just a problem with the battery, so we're getting it hooked up to the Touareg. Yeah, it's just really cold today. Mm -hmm. She's alive! Yeah. 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 Looking good. Yeah. Nice. Wow. Uh -huh. Got all the stuff and charged up battery and tools we're gonna be working on this machine oh so you've already like taken out the spark plugs yeah, and they're out yep. and, uh, also this came off so we we'll need to get a new cable no do you have new cable i have new this oh okay okay also. the terminals nice yeah, nice we'll so. take care of that cool yeah yeah so he took out the spark plugs and he's soaking the cylinders right now in some in kerosene yep so that's good stuff yeah. we're gonna change a bunch of stuff today oil filter all those things okay so we're done unloading a bunch of stuff now we're gonna go get some fresh fuel for this amazing machine and uh yeah hopefully we'll get this thing running tonight uh that's that's the goal basically you know we we haven't you know washed anything at all this car and may the first goal is change oil install new spark plugs soak the cylinders get this thing started put fresh fuel in there get things moving pretty much see all the parts that came with oh. right right it's for the yeah, for the jack for jacking it up so, there's a lot of gaskets it has oh my yeah. god this is looks like a valve gasket maybe be careful yeah oh wow look it's got another distributor yeah that is awesome i think there, there might be a few i don't know i don't know for this even one has a the... pedal pad uh, dude <laughs> yeah, the old one is pretty yeah it's like a lot of ports so this box Let's is start. not really useful right. now so i'll just take it out maybe like put it on the on top of the trunk Whoa okay so that's awesome yeah, look at new, that brand new headlights brand new headlights bulbs that is so cool yeah with the technical everything in russian yeah. right here yeah like this bulbs like that is so cool it's i love it collagen but i'm not sure probably yeah no, it is yeah wow new shocks too nice 
along with the bushings right here. Start taking it out. Yeah. Brand new hubcaps covers. <laughs> that is insane. All of these. Man. Drum brakes. Wow. Lots of parts. Yep. These are the door skins for this car. They're literally brand new. They were actually coated in some oil. That is insane for this car. That is some cool stuff. All four of these. Yeah. And there's another one here too. This is amazing. Yeah, this is easy, so all this rust is gonna come off and basically have new doors. That is crazy. Uh, speedometer cable probably that's what that is Maybe. a lot of cool stuff some yeah, lights Shit. that's awesome yeah. and even first aid kit original original i think there's another word oh it was there yeah yeah oh I mean, <laughs> what is in here Oh, also like a bunch of glasses. Did you find anything? Uh, smell it. Uh -huh. I, don't know it I don't know what that is. It's, it's kind of like some, maybe a, a some cleaner kind of, or something. Yeah, it's solvent. It's, it's dry. So it's dry, yeah. It's fine. Because they have put some fuel in there. somewhere, but... Yeah, that's fine. And we're going to get go through these boxes when we come back to... There's a bunch of parts. Yeah, we also have... Can of oil. Yeah. And, uh, yeah some little by little. Uh, yeah. Man, I'm excited! I'm excited! It's his friend's car, the BMW. Ooh. That's crazy. Yeah, I like the color. It's E46. E46 coupe. That's badass. So she's not driving it right now. She just yeah, uh, it's has a yeah summer car. Yeah, summer that's car. cool. I like the color. I think they made a factory color like that, it's right? Like yeah, it is a factory color. Also, it's like the 2.3 engine. That's oh, awesome. 2.3 engine, you said? Yeah. Nice. What year is this one? 2003? Something, something like that. Yeah. That's cool. Amazing Volvo. She's running again. She's yeah. Man, I wish we had a lot more wagons in the U.S. Man, yeah. United States, they killed the wagons for those. Yeah. Oh, in the suspension, there's a suspension noise. We we'll have yeah. to see. We we'll have to kind of press on this and try to diagnose. But that's for a later thing. Crazy. What a cool machine. Diesel E39. Starting to work on this car. We are gonna be changing the terminals. We have new terminals for the battery. Old ones just went bad, kinda. And we want to change oil on it. I'm gonna take this off as well. Yep. Currently we have the cylinder soaking in some good stuff. Oh, nice. Yep. Cut this uh, yeah. right over here where I was cutting. 
Nice. Good. Like butter. Fresh copper. One. German filter. Yep. Nice. Uh, it looks actually look barely used. Yeah. Uh, installing this one. See if this one fits. Well, that says fuel filter. <laughs> We might not, we may not be lucky, I don't know. Just check. See, look at the threads. Might have to use that other filter. I think filter. it's the same. You think the same threads? It looks the same. Okay. What about the seal? The seal, that one is it bigger, looks, I think, no? Yeah, this one looks smaller. Oh, we might, we can use the... Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Might be bigger, but I think it's like... I think that's the right one. Okay, the front. Barely fits, but it fits. As long as it fits, it ships. Yeah. <laughs> That's the way she goes. Очнулся, упал. Очнулся, гибс. Okay, we got these terminals replaced now. Now what this is from, so we'll figure that out. Some... I'm gonna take this air filter off now. He's a little stuck. Uh, There's one more. Okay. The washers, yeah, it's okay. Just don't lose them. Yeah. Oh. She's nice. Like a virgin. Yeah, they took care of it. Amazing. Yep. Awesome. Oh, right. Let's see. Yeah, it's working. Nice. Pull it all the way out. Okay. That's good. Uh, actually, push it back in for now. Nice. It's working. That's good. Let's check all these hoses. I mean, obviously, they will be. They will need to be replaced and all that. But press the gas pedal. Okay, it's moving. Yes. Move it again. Yeah. Press it. Okay. Release. Yeah. Press. Release. Okay. Yeah, I mean it will need to be lubed up and stuff. That's good. All right. Okay, let's change the oil on it, and then let's get the. Actually, the brake one seems pretty good. It might be just out of brake fluid. It feels like you have pressure. It's not pressure, but it de, you know, gets back up. No, yeah, 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 I know. Well, the brake it, pedal is gonna go back up because there's a spring in there. Yeah, but it's still like... But... I mean, we have some brake fluid we can add yeah. and see if it works. But we the can. clutch is Let's do it. Stuck. Let's add brake fluid too. And we're also gonna put the battery back in here. Okay. <laughs> It kind of fits. It kind of fits. A little bit too big, I think. It's fine. There we go. That is brake fluid, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's fine. It's... We'll flush it if needed. <laughs> Okay, we're about to install this negative cable and apply power to this car after 25 years. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Uh, if I can make this work. Oh, there it is. <coughs> Is it showing anything? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Okay, hold on. 
Might be. I need Are, did you turn the key to the on position, like all the way, or uh, oh. the lights have to come on on the cluster? Maybe you you didn't go all the way yet. Uh, second, second position. Yeah. Okay, and the last position is like cranking or what? Should be. I mean, it's... or something is. Let's see. We can try. What's the worst that can happen? It won't start the spark plugs. No, so... no. Is the ignition kind of sticky or? Yeah, it feels a bit. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Let me double check here. Because it didn't spark when I connected this at all. So we got to check like the fuses or whatever it goes to. I think there are fuses in the, on your side. This is the oil that's still in there. Is it showing anything? It's 15 volts. Oh. Yeah. So it seems it like it's not dead. So now I'm going to drain the oil, but first I'm going to take this shield off. There she is. The drain is basically the same like on differentials. It's kind of crazy. The drain plug. And this is the, unfortunately, a few bolts broke. They're just so rusted. And, but they, this is the cover. It weights a lot too. It's the cover for the wheel pan. It's like, yeah, it's super heavy. Like three millimeters. Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. So I checked the terminals on the battery. They're good. This ignition needs lubrication too. So, get the thing turned. But there's nothing really happening. This ignition is a little sticky too. Check the battery terminals, they're good. I think these fuses are bad. <laughs> so, let's see. I think we got brake lights so far, yeah. right? We do. And then, so the battery is all good and everything. And then we'll turn this. Come on. Patient. Oh, you see that? That comes on right there, the, the light. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that, right away. See that? That's already working. Okay, we're gonna keep digging. Лейка может возьми, не? Это воронка. Там 
Или сделаешь так? Ну, я не знаю, это... Не ко мне, воп... не ко мне вопрос, это... А, так она полная еще, ага. Ну, ладно, ладно, аккуратно. Ой-ой-ой-ой-ой. и пол-литра мусь быть что, раунд 2, а? clean that nope, let it slide down it doesn't want to go it's going, but there's ah, there's a filter that's why I am I mean, it's a thicker oil too. No, oh, it's a filter, I think, because uh, there's a like small particle one, I think. Yeah. Probably in there somewhere. How much did we put already? Like two liters? Uh, actually around. No, nothing close. Okay. Half a liter. Okay. Anti-rust. Да вот щупнича, блядь, там километровая Fresh oil. Нормально, дуплава. Okay. See if it does anything. I doubt it. Ну и даже в туме, да. Oh, oh, something happened. Started it something. I heard the. Where's your hammer? Actually, uh, what? Huh? Neutral. Oh. Oh. <laughs> all right, hold on. So what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna crank it, so all that everything that's in the cylinders is gonna get out of there. Yeah. And then that way we can put the spark plugs in. Ah, uh, see. It's, I think we that's have okay. To get it. Yeah, the starters might maybe a little sticky. Yeah, I just yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, I see that. <laughs> No, I'm telling you, these these fuses are trash. I mean, they're gonna need to get yeah. replaced. So this is the alternator <laughs> we're using right now, right right there, because we don't have the fuses right now. So we're just using this, the temporary fuse. Don't do that. But something came up. Yep, next slide. Yeah. I think it might so definitely this this <coughs> fuse now it's not seized. The starter. No, it's just this problem right here. Do you have sandpaper? Uh, yeah. Let's get the sandpaper out. <laughs> it looks so good. Yeah, I think it's just the switch. I mean, we can disconnect it there. Disconnect it or no, or diffuse. Uh, Is the fuse on the same circuit uh, for the wipers? Can you uh, check? What do you would see? Hold on. Neutral? Neutral? Cool. Starter is working. Now we can install spark plugs yeah. and see if she starts for real, real. Uh, also, if you will. Welcome. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome. All right, we got new spark plugs ready to go. <laughs> All right, good. Yep. <laughs> Давай другую тогда. 
В другой веке особо нет. Такое, чтобы подошла туда. Ага. Все. Oh, fresh fuel. Fresh fuel that she oh. hasn't seen in a long yeah, time. It's 95 octane, so yeah. it, it probably never saw it. So it has a little sieve there, so it's something falls. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, don't smoke here. Сейчас, подожди, вот тут. It should get hard at some point. That's what she said. Yeah, exactly. You're right. Hopefully. If it's not, uh, Hopefully nothing is clogged too. Clogged or rusted off somewhere in between. Yep. Push the button. <laughs> yeah. In the worst case, we can try to. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. 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 See if it starts. Yeah, I'm gonna try. Uh, do we have spark? Yeah, we may not have spark. We may or may not have spark. Need to check that. Let's pop this open actually because it's probably like in the horrible shape in there, you know. Hold on. All right, now it's probably really frozen. Hold on. Wow, yeah. Wonder if this is also part of that. Hold on. You see this one? We might have to remove this. I don't know what that is. The little nut. It's fine. Good. There you go. Never mind. Ooh. Looks it's not decent, too too but... normal. Okay, we can add some, grab some sandpaper and clean it. No, you Давай. No, I'm not seeing spark. So at this moment, what we have an issue with is we don't have spark. And I already checked everything, spark plug wires, distributor, distributor cap, everything is good. And we actually replaced and installed brand new distributor cap we actually had. So, and we have in the ignition coil, where the ignition coil is, we do have positive coming in and um and it's 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 pulsing so and we still don't have spark coming out of the ignition coil so that's a bad ignition coil unfortunately we don't have the ignition coil right now so i'm just trying to use this old school method of kind of getting this thing you know to work it's actually still this ignition coil is original made in ussr yeah so the ignition coil is gonna most likely need to be replaced unless if we can get it to fire up i already added fresh fuel to the carb and it's actually getting really nice and firm now so i, I think we do have fuel here i'll double check again Right guys, welcome back to another video series of restoration of an amazing old school legendary machine, Vaz 2101. So this is, my friend has been working on this car, has been cleaning the interior and doing other stuff to this car. And we still, uh, he actually installed a new ignition coil on it. Uh, and he still had no spark, so I came by today and we're gonna try to start it and check what's going on with it. He said that the old ignition coil was still bad. He, he checked the resistances and stuff and 
it was open on the secondary coil winding so it was still bad but yeah uh let's let's show you guys some progress of this car so the engine base still kind of looks the same we have a new ignition coil but uh you know the the distributor cap it was replaced it's brand new actually just a new old stock um have this opened up what's interesting is it has uh, a fuse in there so that fuse is actually bad because i checked the resistance across and this it's open but that's on the secondary side but we were still chasing an issue with the spark not coming out of the ignition coil so after he replaced it he still had no spark but then ended up uh, cleaning some of the the contacts so uh, we turned the engine by hand a little bit uh, until these two contacts opened up so i was able to shove a small piece of sandpaper in there and clean it and now actually we do have spark at least we did have spark uh, a little while ago so this is the setup i just have this tape right here and this this is connected to the battery negative as well and we're gonna see if it still has spark or not in a second but yeah that's that's how the progress has been going hopefully tonight we're gonna have the first start and then we're gonna show you the interior a little bit so inside the car uh rafal has been cleaning like the seats a little bit here and there uh make sure to follow him on instagram it's gonna be right here uh and then uh yeah slowly but surely i mean this this car i mean he took out the those seat covers they were pretty nasty moldy. yeah so little by little we're gonna and uh you know we're gonna get this car rolling but you said you also replaced the fuses already right the, uh, oh wow you actually put uh quite a few new fuses in there as well you guys know a lot of old school benzes have the same style fuses this is really cool yep and uh, these are actually still okay i think most of them were fine uh, as far as i remember we, we, we were messing with them last video but yeah she's still a little dirty but that's not a huge deal the main thing is getting the engine running and other stuff and this is going to get cleaned up later on but yeah just really excited to finally hopefully tonight we're going to have the first start of this car all right guys i'm going to be filming it without the flashlight and he's going to crank the engine and we're going to be looking at for spark right in this area all right go ahead try it look at that we do have spark already we do have nice spark so we're gonna start putting everything back together the only thing is i want to double check this fuse we do have another fuse i believe to install in here because if i install the cap right now it's still gonna be no spark at the spark plugs okay so this is actually a new old stock that came with this car and what we're looking for is this little fuse right there so we're gonna check to see if that one is good should be good kind of this one we checked there's no continuity but i'm sure it's supposed to have continuity so we're just gonna take this housing off carefully and inspect okay so plastic. that's plastic yep but to change or take this fuse up maybe there's just like corrosion on the contacts or something because yeah. it's supposed to have it's a fuse it's supposed to have continuity but there's no continuity at the moment so I'm gonna try to take this fuse out. Okay, so this rotor, when we check it, when we check it, it shows resistance. But then this one, the original one, it's actually not showing much. So hold this for a second. And then let's show them that one and then this one. So that fuse must be bad. So we're just gonna go ahead and replace this with, with a new one, actually. This is in great condition, brand new, old stock. Made in USSR, yup. So we're about to have a first start, man. First start after it was parked in what 1997? Uh, yeah. Probably around there. Yeah. yeah. Does it fit? Looks like it does. Yeah. So where is 
see it? This one right here. Okay. Oh, so let's set it back on there. Let's see. Looks like. Yeah, it's gonna go one way on this one. This one install in the middle. And we're about to crank it again, check for spark or by the spark plug right there. Right, everything is installed here. He's about to crank it and we'll see if we have spark. Uh, go ahead whenever you're ready. Try again. Stop. I think we have a, a bad contact here. Okay, try again. <laughs> Nothing. Why? Okay, we're gonna recheck from the coil again. Crank it. Okay. Okay, so this contact, what I noticed, the middle one, it was kind of in too much i feel like so i kind of pulled it out a little bit it's like spring loaded a little so hopefully now fuse is still good so we'll retry it again clean one no this is brand new so it should be fine it's just that metal contact was messed up a little i think okay ended up doing the resistance measurements on all the four wires here one of them this number three is open the other showed some resistance so but this number three is open but we do have spark i checked the spark right now we do have spark right there so raffle is gonna take off this uh air lid uh housing and i'm trying to pump up this uh fuel valve some more last time it was pretty like firm now it's like loose again it's almost like there's no pressure again from the fuel mm, yeah Adding a little more fuel because there's literally nothing coming to the engine at all. Okay. This one's so all right. Mm -hmm. Neutral. Mm hmm. Okay. Try a little more. Pedal to the floor. Yep. Try again. Hold on. It's not opening here again. Yeah, take take it off. Yep. Let's try now. Try it. Let's, uh, let's give the battery a little bit of charge. And we're still trying to figure out the fuel supply here, but she's showing signs of life. So this is what we've come up with. We're gonna be pouring fuel as fresh gasoline inside of there. And this is going to the carburetor. We were not able at the moment to get fuel, you know, from the tank, but that will get figured out. But right now we're just gonna use this and start pouring fuel through there oh a little too much <laughs> okay let's see hold on we just gotta go slow i think yeah just had a little bit much get them yep No, stop. It's not trying at all. Uh, oh, did you press the gas pedal? No. Let's try to do that. 
try now. Actually, wait, this thing went down. The fuel. No, it actually didn't. It's still there. Okay, try it. Давай. Давай еще чуть-чуть. Газ в пол давай. One eternity later. Yeah, it definitely is cleaning up a little bit here and there. I gotta clean it some more. That's not bad. Oh! Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> These glasses came with this car. <laughs> 40 yeah. years old. Yeah. And also, Viktor Tsoi. Hello. Favorite Viktor Tsoi. All right, hopefully tonight we'll get her running. Yeah, Rafael's been doing a lot of work. Yeah. He's been changing the, you know, he changed the silicone, those uh, spark plug wires. They were bad, at least one or two of them were bad, we've discovered. Yeah, and you know, while I was away, he did some, actually almost, he almost got this engine to start before he pulled well, the carburetor off. Start, but like for two seconds. Yeah, for like two yeah. seconds. Yeah. Mm. Oh, really? Let's try that. That's our uh, portable new fuel tank. Yep. <laughs> Half a liter, so it's like quarter. And a little bit of this. Nice. Ready? But you have to press the gas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I can just. I'll do it here. Yeah, we want to try to see it. Yeah, I am. All right. Oh, 
Let's try again. On będzie to rozlatce w tym problemie. No ale we can try. Yeah, we can try to tilt it a little this way. Maybe we need some kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna hold it. Yeah, I'm gonna hold it. So. Right. That's good. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> Our favorite fumes are out. Oh. <laughs> Getting high. Getting oh, high from is. gasoline. It's a little slot, Fireball. <laughs> yeah. Yep. All right. Try. Just try like this right now. <laughs> yeah. I think I got it on the video. <laughs> We're gonna try it again. Uh. Yeah, we gotta get that sip right there. Yep, just, just a sip. Surprise, surprise. Okay, so three, two. Mm -hmm. Woo! Then? No way. No, no, no fuel. Try again? No. Oh, there was something. <laughs> <laughs> okay so fuel feed coming to the pump from the pump we just double checked that when it's cranking the fuel is coming out so go ahead go for it we might have to crank it. okay keep cranking it Take it easy, take it easy. Well, Try. It, uh, starts when springs. Okay, I'm not spraying anything right now, you know? Yeah. So we just need to keep pumping more yeah, fuel. We start, huh? We start, keep oh, it keeps cranking? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It, it stops. It stops. Yeah. 
No, that's fine. So like you have to release the key, right? When it starts, release the key. I do, but then it stops. That that's okay. We just have to keep on doing it until maybe we'll catch. Потихоньку, потихоньку. <laughs> really? Huh. Are you saying that we're losing spark when you release the key? Uh, I guess, yeah, probably. So I think the ignition switch is bad on it because as soon as he releases the key, uh, we are losing spark. So what we're, we're going to do right now is we're going to take a jumper cable from the battery positive to the battery to the positive of the, of the ignition coil yeah after it goes out and then <laughs> yeah there's a little bit of fumes <laughs> we're gonna let it air out but we had a big progress right now actually it's it's nice как ощущение raffle вообще да Советская техника легенда скоро живет. Okay. Hold on. Uh, go ahead. Oh, there is a positive. Like... Okay, that's good. That's yeah. good. That's fine. Ooh. All right, set it up. Look at that! She's running! It freaking oh, rounds, oh, man! We did it, mate! Good job, mate! Oh, you know. <laughs> Dude, like, <laughs> hell yeah, man! All this work, dude! And yeah, definitely an issue with the ignition switch. It shouldn't be. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she was drinking she it. Sucks. Yeah, she's sucking on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, man. but there's something with the electrical. That's okay. That's that's yeah, another thing. It's yeah, fixable. it's just probably just the ignition switch that's bad because it, when you yeah. release the key, it should because, still get yeah. positive to because, this. You know. Yeah. Now when I put it on the like, yeah. uh, you know, the main position, yep. there's no ignition light. Yeah. But yeah. when you put this shit on, it was on. Yeah. So yeah. I I was being it's an ignition alive. switch. <laughs> She's <It's> alive. alive. <laughs> Man. Legendary machine. Woo! We're dancing, dancing, dancing! Oh, <laughs> Real Italians right now. Because these are made in Italy. Yeah. It's crazy. Also, the Fiat sign is probably. Yeah, the Fiat sign also says it all probably right here. Oh, look! Oh, they're working? Of course. They are working. All right, take it easy over there, pal. I turned them off. Turned them off. I did, but... They need to go to rest right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, can you check the lights? Or go? Yeah. Checking the lights. Go oh. for it. Just the lower ones are working. No. 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 Nope. about this? Nothing. Maybe the key has to be on. The no, it's no. on, but like... I'm oh, okay. okay the, no, the, just the lower ones are on, but not the not the low beams. Everything is up? Yep. Pump the clutch pedal a little bit. Yeah, but it's... Well, actually, it started working. It started yeah. working? Yeah, yeah. Oh, but... man. Yeah. What an amazing car. First... Put it, it back in neutral. Yeah, it doesn't want to go in first. It did go like a, a little, little bit, ago, but yeah, uh, it goes second, third, fourth. There you go. That's oh, first. Okay, so we have it. In, I got I have it, to, daddy. Yeah. Have it, like, uh, the okay, but let's make sure so it's still uh, it's on the jack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you can try to spin. The yeah, both tires. Ghost, ghost. Yeah, well, these are pretty. <laughs> Hold the clutch right now, okay? 
Well, we don't know, but let's see. I'm about to put it. Yeah, I'll tell you when to release the clutch, okay? Okay, go ahead. And start it up and let's see. Okay. Start releasing the clutch. It's trying to go. It's trying. Huh? What'd you say? Something was happening. I felt like vibration. No, I felt like it kind of moved a little bit, like this, the the wheel. Okay, so but maybe it's just locked up a little bit. The you know? clutch cylinder might be. Yeah. It's it was trying to go. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, like. Well, you can't. This barely spins. This tire. You know what I mean? Yeah, but probably if it breaks. Even it, even when it's in the air in the first gear, you would still have to give it some gas to because that yeah, that brake, brake is yeah. locked up pretty <laughs> bad. Work, the gas <laughs> work with yeah, that brake is locked up. The brake is locked up and the yeah. gas is also like not. Yeah. Uh, the process. Uh, the choke. Yeah, the choke. Mm -hmm. yeah. Try to give it a little gas. Okay. Slow. She just need. Yeah, she just needs a little bit of love. But okay. Press. What about now? Okay, that's fine. That's enough for today, I think. Yeah, we made progress. Yeah, progress. <laughs> oh man, she's alive. She is alive and amazing.